right around that 9-7, right in the middle of the pack, making these types of games down the stretch mark very impies in this game. Chitobu, the replacement for Castleton, gets the feed. Lawrence, one of the top scorers for this Commodore squad, number zero in white. Robbins going to work inside with the left hand. Thought about it, now leans into oh. a mid-range jumper. Of the game in his last three. Pull-up jumper is good for Kyle. Maybe the NIT if they keep playing well. Good take that time by Mignon. They've been outstanding. Mignon was not the starter at the beginning of the year, but boy, they found gold with him. Games missed that time. There's Robbins, and he's hammered on the offensive rebound. Tom has Liam Robbins as number one in the country. In the four games, he's been to the free throw line 56 times. That's an Kugel. Kugel, shake and bake in the trees, puts it up there, and Kugel remains scorching hot for this championship. Lawrence finds space and finds an open three. Oh, the points are coming in flurries here. Action. Little floater off the baseline. Too strong. Mignon on a blow by. Mignon takes it right at the big man. That time a prayer not answered by Kugel. They work it around. Kugel on an open three. Got it. Great ball movement. Mignon go off two feet. Studi angles it in to Robbins. Five on the shot clock. Robbins banging inside. Jump hooks. Kugel with a hand in his face. He had Robbins' hand right in his face, and he fires up. Gets not, it. Not a fan of the step back jumper to begin with. Yeah, that's a double. And it doesn't matter. An and one for Liam Robbins. Look for a double. It doesn't come. So he works his way back into that high rent district. Gets the foul in the. And so played his first two years at Drake, one year at Minnesota. To him. Trust your coaches. Mignon. Uh -oh. No patience needed there. Uh oh. A quick three. Quick threes. Shimmy on a three. Long rebound. Another three. Kugel with the response. But that three's a better three. Wise three. Robbins and Mignon playing a nice little two man game. Studi, don't let him get hot. When he's on, he's still a premier. No. Kugel, shake and bake, pull up jumper. Wow. <laughs> oh my goodness. Right. And just scoring. Kugel had a career high 24 against Kentucky. Studi, pressure the first half, a six point game. Kugel already with 12 points and another three hit by the. Threes on the year, shot that with confidence, but in response, Kugel. Good start so far. Already with four threes. Studi knows a thing or two about threes. That's his second in the league. This game, Kugel feeling it. Kugel on a leader off the window. Gets his own rebound and missed the lefty. How about a third attempt and draws the foul? To his left, the step back, tries to draw the foul. Gets the rebound, quick second jump. And then muscle. But an offensive rebound. And a jumper to follow. That's Paul Lewis. Reeves trapped. Reeves just throws oh. it up there and kisses it home. What do you see? Laura Brown handoff for and that's gonna say reverse layup. Thomas just took it. Jatobo muscling in on Melora Brown. Now Lewis finds a cutting Melora Brown who jams it home. Jones up top. And I can stuff it. Vanderbilt stuck and maybe they did it in just one possession yeah. Rising not a good Largest lead for the Commodores, but an answer inside by Florida defense and points per possession when they were only giving up about point 94 73 a game and you're seeing how quickly they can heat up Straight away three Lofton rattles one home. I think it's Lofton Watch, he receives a screen, comes off another screen, the dribble handoff, then attacks the rim. Lofton's been thousand years. He does, simply doesn't get tired. Cut three seconds on the shot clock. Nothing but net from downtown out of the right hand of Collins. Evans are also taking advantage of the three-point line. Collins point game. A little over two minutes to go in the first half, and there is the man they call. Should be a lot of fun. Point. 
Oh, this is an illegal screen. Jim Robbins. Robbins on the other end. Missed the slam, but he was fouled. Did that. Watch Robbins give ground, drop coverage, blocks you. Well, might be a short night at the office. At least six rebounds, a couple of blocks mixed in. And he gets the friendly from Robbins. Probing the right side. Mignon dips he too. What a shot. Five seconds left. Lofton pulls up the jumper. Got it. And that's how the half. 36, our halftime score as we get you ready for the second and say hello and welcome. Mid-range jumpers. He also has the ability to not come hard to guard. And Vanderbilt right now is just that. It's the right guy. Will Richard, who's their best three-point shooter at 40%. And Hanford. One of the impressive things in this game. He's going to get a look. Because outside game. Analytics will tell you that's the worst shot in Don Daly. And I think Robbins has got a little blood on his left wrist area. Look at this rim protection against Jatobo. Need to get something going on offense. Quickest. And lethal point guards in the Southeastern Conference. Robbins, right. Mignon, and this team. Be a heck of a... Well, okay, if we're From going for the Commodores now, 16 points. Gators just trying to find some offense. That freed up Shemchik. Kugel didn't feel like he got the foul. On the season, of course, hit that buzzer beater, the shot of the year for the Commodores against Tennessee in this very building. Teams two weeks ago, nice feed from Kugel, finds the gliding Will Richard. And again. This is almost a five-out offense. With Shim Approaching the 13-minute mark, it's a 12-point game. When in doubt, go to block to block. Take a look at problem for a depleted front court already for Florida. That means Jatobo. Ken Palm. Robbins is number one in the country.